I was reading the other day in Air and Space Forces magazine, and they was talking about a young lady, a contractor that died. She went into a propeller. She, the engine was moving, and it happens across the country. It said the death of a contractor killed last year after they did the investigation when she walked into the moving propeller of an MQ-9 during ground tests was blamed on a confluence of factors, including inadequate training, poor lighting, uh, noise conditions, poor conditions, and a rush to finish testing, all of which contributed, contributed to the victim's loss of situational awareness. Because she lost situational awareness, she went into the engine of a moving propeller and it killed her instantly. Good God Almighty. When you are not situationally aware, you think that these people are your friends and you're walking into a propeller and you don't even know what you're getting yourself into because you are not situationally aware. Many of us are in fake relationships that have swallowed us up because we lost situational awareness. Many of us are in fake friendships that have swallowed us up and they're getting ready to eat us alive because we have lost situational awareness. When you're dealing with people who are close to you but don't know how to compliment you, they have nothing positive to say about you, you are losing situational awareness and you are dealing with a deadly propeller. Be careful when some of these fellas are propellers. You're dealing with propellers that's going to swallow you up. One thing that I realize, people that don't really love you don't have anything good to say to you, even in your face. You're dealing with a propeller. Even in your face, to your face, they can't even think like they like you for real. When they can't stand you, Jerome, so much, they can't even play like they love you. They have nothing good to say to you, even in your face.